First at 430, Tennessee Governor Bill Lee made a stop in Memphis this morning. Thank you for joining us. I'm April Thompson. I'm Alex Coleman. The governor spent about an hour by the river taking a hard look at the condition of the old I-55 bridge. Plans are in the works for a new multi-million dollar bridge. And as WREG's Mike Suriani reports, the governor was impressed by what's on the drawing board. It's an iconic bridge for an iconic city and it's going to be done in a remarkably different way. Tuesday morning, Tennessee Governor Bill Lee getting a look at the proposed new bridge to replace the present I-55 bridge, an $800 million project wider and much safer than the present structure. The technology behind a cable stay is what you see in a lot of area mm -hmm. seismic zones like Memphis is. So again, it's a good fit, um, but it will be a signature signature bridge for not only the city, but for the region and the country. It's beautiful. The new bridge will be known as America's River Crossing, the reasonable and economic solution to building a third bridge. And what are you going to do with this bridge if you spend a billion or two billion on the third river crossing, you're still stuck with a 75 year old bridge. Construction on the I-55 Crump Interchange continues with plans to dovetail new lanes into the new I-55 bridge when completed, possibly by 2050. You can't really appreciate how unsafe that bridge is unless you brave a walk on one of its pedestrian lanes. Tuesday, Governor Lee donned a hard hat and did just that. Lee and other dignitaries made a short walk of it, and when he reached solid ground... We need a new bridge. <laughs> we need a new bridge. He can walk across that bridge, and uh, it's, uh, it needs to be replaced. A fact well known to Memphis leaders. Uh, the chamber has been working on the replacement of this bridge for more than 20 years, working with officials in Nashville as well as D.C. to ensure that they understood the importance of our infrastructure here. For your news leader downtown, I'm Mike Suri on the WREG News Channel 3. And don't forget, the I-55 bridge will be closed this weekend starting Saturday at 4 a.m. until Monday at 6 a.m. During this time, you will not be able to cross I-55 north or south across the Mississippi. You can use the I-40 bridge as an alternate route.